Ashley and Brittany, you share a deep connection and an unbreakable bond. Your love is truly a gift from God. Life has a way of teaching us what it is that we want and need in a partner. Someone who brings a sense of ease and comfort to our lives. A partner who is caring. Someone who is cheerful. A partner who is cozy. Someone who is calming. A partner who is corny. <laughs> and someone who is clever. All the C's. And someone who is our very best friend in this world. Ashley, how lucky are we to have our first hangout on St. Patrick's Day? Because I truly feel lucky to have you in my life. And I think it only makes sense that our first kiss was on April Fool's Day, because we love to laugh until we cry sometimes. The sound of your laughter has become my favorite melody. vow to always care for you, connect with you, comfort you, and celebrate you. I promise to surprise you and make sure you always have coffee. I promise to love you with everything that I am, to be your light in your dark and your very best adventure buddy. Brittany, from the moment you asked for my number over a blueberry muffin recipe, to the day you asked me to be your girlfriend, and now as we stand here, um, you have been the fearless architect of our love story. I promise to love you wholeheartedly and unconditionally. When it rains in our lives and the gray skies are hard to navigate, I promise to be hand in hand with you, jumping into puddles under the streetlights in search of rainbows. I promise to embrace our silliness, <clears throat> to laugh so hard we cry, Sometimes questioning if a breathing emergency is in progress. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and cherish all the whimsical melodies that cross our paths as we continue our unpredictable and unforgettable journey together. I'm so excited for the beautiful, crazy life we have ahead of us. I love you. We pray for harmony and true happiness as we forever grow young together. May you always make time for each other and never let life get too busy. May you always need one another, not so much to fill your emptiness as to help you know your fullness. Nurture your love with kindness and gratitude and listen to each other with the intent to understand. Stand strongly together because after all, it is the two of you against the world. By the power vested in me, I pronounce you wife and wife. You make it! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yeah. I now present Woo! to you the newly married couple, Mrs. and Mrs. Egbert. Is there a message that you would like to send to future Brittany and Ashley? Oh, Ooh, yeah. yeah. Ashley, do you want to go first? Oh, gosh. Um, when things get hard, just make sure you continue to, to hold each other and work through it. Like, touch, yeah. you know, stay close to each other. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Touch is so a love language. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. It's really good. Yeah. Yeah, I think um, our future selves. Um, stop and slow down mm -hmm. um, and take in the moments, especially today has gone by really fast and yeah. with, you know, kids and work and everything, I think we need to just slow it down a mm -hmm. little bit. Yeah. So, and always touch and communication. Mm -hmm. yeah. Always work on that every day. Yeah.